Hi all, welcome to this team of the season, Marcus Alonso play review. Honest to God, this 90 rated card is absolutely insane. With a basic chem style, he practically goes into his own personal club. He is absolutely godly. So if you can smash the likes, it'll be awesome. Sub to the channel if you're new. Follow me on Twitter, G is legend. All the links are down below for playlists in the channel and social media links as always. So let's jump into this player review. So Marcus Alonso has played 6 games for me, he got 3 goals with a price range of 27,000 to 500,000 coins with his main attribute positives are his pace, his dribbling and being an all rounded card, he is just absolutely insane. With his biggest weaknesses is actually his work rates and positioning because he is very attacking but also very defensive that you can sometimes find him playing very very deep or very very attacking and it is just very difficult to find the right balance. I've played him as a left back, I've heard people play him in left mid and left wing, um, I would probably play him in a left wing if I didn't have um, play them on Sun to be honest, I think left wing would probably combat that kind of issue, but he has 88 pace, 88 shot, 92 dribbling, 92 physical, 87 defending and 91 passing, we paid 230,000 coins, we eventually sold them on for 270k, I'd missed so many in advance for around 150-200k, but 6 games, 3 goals, I had a couple rage quits as well which was a bit of a bummer, could have had a bit more games, but left footed high high work rate. So he's got 81 aggression, 92 com uh, 72 composure, 83 interceptions, 93 attack position, 84 acceleration, 83 agility, 91 sprint speed, 99 stamina, 90 strength which is pretty insane, 94 ball control, 98 crossing, 89 free kick accuracy which is very on point, 99 shot power so you can give that a right good test with um, 98 long shots as well and 87 marking. Penalties is pretty impressive, 90 slide tackle and 90 stand tackle as well. Left mid, left back, 6 foot 2, 178 pounds with engine, long shot taker and takes finesse free kicks. In game performances he was absolutely insane, his dribbling is something else. Now, I had Hector Bellerin as his opposite fullback and you could see a major, major difference between Bellerin to Marcus Alonso, especially in terms of a dribbling and just controlling the ball. He has 3 star weak foot, 3 star scrimmage, don't worry about that, those don't even play into his factors. He is just so nimble that you can just dribble for fun, doesn't matter who you're playing against, this card is genuinely insane, I'd, he's probably the best left back. or he's, Quite even possibly the best defender I've ever used on a FIFA. He is just absolutely godly. He will just dribble and dribble for fun. The pace is just there to complement and he will just run rampant at defences. You could, If you play him at left wing he might just be a right nuisance even more. As I said I played him at left back and it was giving me the opportunity to play very attacking with him but also be very defensive with him. On free kicks he hit the post on a couple of occasions, he was very very close on a couple of occasions. The goalkeepers were just absolutely just doing their job and I was testing him every opportunity whether it be a set piece, a penalty, corner, long shots, you name it, I was trying everything. Dribbling was what he stands out massively at, his shooting is on point when you give him a good chance on goal and free goal for his return is impressive and when you can dribble through the fences with ease with him and I'm something I can lack it a little but with this card it just makes it so easy and honest to god it is an absolute card I would recommend buying I'm going to buy him again anyway unless I pack him so as a review I'm giving him 9.5 out of 10 I'd highly recommend him guys go and try him out you will love his card to bits it's, uh, there's very few faults in him so I hope you enjoy this review remember to smash the likes sub to channel for new and I'll catch you all later